Thanks for joining in on the next segment of the LinkedIn Social Selling Playbook for Sales Managers. In this section, we're going to look at social st- selling statistics. So why do you want to look at social selling statistics? Well, first of all, to understand the benefits of social selling, you need to understand the buyer side and the seller side. So first of all, on buyer's profiles as it relates to social selling, 92% of buyers, and these are B2B buyers or business-to-business buyers, start their search online. 49% of buyers research vendors through their LinkedIn profiles. 50% of buyers avoid people with an incomplete profile on LinkedIn. 44% of buyers use shared connections to find potential vendors. So what they do is they ask their friends or connections if they know anyone that does specific things when they're starting their search. 74% of buyers choose the sales professional that was the first to add value and insight to their organization or to their process. 84% of buyers start their buying process with a referral. That doesn't necessarily mean it's on LinkedIn, but a big portion of these people will leverage LinkedIn to find a referral that they can go through. Warm referrals increase your sales success by two times to four times. Cold calls are only successful less than 2.5% of the time, and this comes from a study that IBM did that was referenced by LinkedIn. In fact, there's another report out based on cold calls that were done by Keller Williams Real Estate, and they found that cold calls were successful less than 1% of the time. And then last but not least, LinkedIn traffic converts into sales leads 277% more than Facebook and Twitter. And that comes from HubSpot. The rest of these actually come from statistics in different LinkedIn white papers. Now, here's the tips as it relates to this. So make sure that your team members have at least pictures in their profiles. If they have their picture in their profile, then what happens is the chances of them getting looked at or their profile being looked at increases by 13-fold. You also should make sure that your team has a complete profile. Remember back to the point that You know, basically 50% of buyers go online on LinkedIn and look at profiles to find people and they'll discount at least 50% right off the bat if they don't have a complete profile. So what that means is literally if you don't have a complete profile or your team doesn't have a complete profile, 75% of the time they're going to be absolutely discounted from being looked at. Make sure that your team lets their contacts know exactly what they do so that their connections can actually refer them into other people. Make sure that you're using specific keywords in your summaries and also in your profile and everything that you want to get found on or want your team members to get found on by ideal prospects. Send information to your connections that add value. So if your company has white papers or they've created a blog post or a video or any kind of content, make sure that your team is actively engaging with their connections and sending this information through to them. Make sure that you leverage your first level connections to get into the second level connections. And we'll go into more detail in another segment in this course on how to do that. And also, make sure your team stops cold calling and starts leveraging their LinkedIn connections to get meetings. So here's seller's profiles. Social selling leaders have 45% more opportunities in their pipeline. And my take on this is that because they're engaging with their connections on LinkedIn and leveraging the referrals, they're getting more opportunities coming into the pipeline. Social selling leaders are also 51% more likely to hit quota, and that goes with the number above. If they've got more opportunities, their chances of actually hitting quota would be higher because of the fact that they'll be able to close more business. Sales managers that level social selling for themselves and their team become sales directors 52% faster. Sales directors that leverage social selling become vice presidents of sales 41% faster. Salespeople who reach out with valuable insight are five times more likely to get a response 
compared to those that reach out cold. So think of it this way. If your reps are just reaching out to people either by the phone or in fact by uh, LinkedIn and they have no insight, no value, anything like that, then you know what? The ones that are actually reaching out with the white papers, with the videos, with the blog posts, with, with the information are five times more likely to get a response from an individual. 78% of salespeople who use social selling process outperform their peers, and that comes from salesforce.com. And sales reps who exceed their quota on LinkedIn with uh, engage with their prospects 39% more than other sales professionals. So here's some tips. Get your team to start incorporating social selling tactics so that they can increase their likelihood of exceeding quota and getting more opportunities in the pipeline which subsequently also means that your team is hitting their plan. As a sales manager or sales director, make sure that you're leveraging social selling for yourself and also for your team so that you get promoted faster. And obviously being promoted faster means that you get a better salary. Have your team follow their prospects and clients online and send them relevant information. And when I say online, I mean through LinkedIn. We'll get into that in another segment in this course and show you how to do that. If your prospect or clients are sharing content or writing posts, make sure that you like, share, and or comment on all of these. So that's not only for yourself, but that's for your sales team. So key takeaways here, buyers are using social media and specifically LinkedIn to help in their buying process. Sales professionals that use LinkedIn and other social media platforms are more likely to exceed quota, make more money, and get promoted faster. If you'd like to reach out and figure out how I can help your sales team engage and do more and help you achieve plan, quota, and everything else, you can reach out to me at chris at salestipaday.com. My phone number is 403 630 one, two, four, three, or you can go to ca.linkedin.com forward slash in forward slash Chris Hamilton CA to connect with me on LinkedIn.